Hey everybody, we're back at Dollar Tree and there's some spooky finds for Halloween. Let's check it out. So first up we have the cute little gnome ornaments. I remember these in the US from last year, but they never came to Canada. So this year they're in Canada. And these are new. Look at these cute little ornament sets. You have the one with the ghost and the one with the bats. So that's pretty good. That's like something you would see at Michael's. And they had lots of ornaments for if you're doing a Halloween tree, we're gonna hang it on a garland. And that one with the uh, spider webs. Really pretty, great design. Like the eyeball ones there, great colors. And they had the skulls and the jack-o'-lanterns again. And the pumpkins with the haunted mansions. They've had those before. So here's a close-up of the ornaments. Here's the bats and the purple ornaments. And the ghost with the orange. Great find. And then they had lots of the garland, the flowers. They had ghost garland, the zombie garland. The little bottle, jars of poison, the spider rings, here's the garland, sorry, this is the wreath decoration kit. So they had the ghost, the witch's feet, the zombie, the skeleton, so that's a fun find, that's how it could look. And they had the pics as well for Halloween. These were candy jars, so they had the pumpkins, just a couple different ones, some cute trays as well. Now these trays with the ghost, they light up, they glow in the dark, so they had the tray with the ghost, they had this one with the bats. This all glows in the dark. There's plates. The plates match the tray. I'm just trying to get one out. There you go. There's the plates. So it's kind of fun. Glow in the dark. Lots of bags for Halloween. Happy Halloween. Ghostly greetings. Trick or treat. And lots of signs for outside or inside. Welcome to our frightfully haunted home. And these are great find. I'm surprised they came to Canada. Remind me of Joanna Parker. There's three different ones. The ghost, the cat, and the witch with the pumpkin there. And lots of great signs. Happy Halloween. And they had some, I guess these are, well, they're footprint decor. I guess like a zombie's foot. They were fun. Cute little owl below with his hat on. Lots more great bowls. They had the ghost, the spider webs, and the jack-o'-lanterns. These ones didn't glow in the dark, but still cute find. There's the bulb side that glows in the dark. Lots of great lights for Halloween. The spiders, the bats, the ghosts, the jack-o'-lanterns. Cute little pails. I like the one with the haunted house and the ghost. Here's a close-up of the jack-o'-lanterns. The other one with the haunted mansion. The white and the orange one. Lots more great signs. The witches here. The skeletons. The stacked pumpkins, that's fun. I like that one. Trick or treat. And they had the long signs as well. Welcome my pretties, that one's fun. They had the jars of the poison, the zombie brew, witch's brew, well, unfiltered poison, that's fun. They've had those years before. That's a good find. And more of the lights. So they have the skeleton here, the purple bat, and the jack-o'-lantern. You get 10 in a pack. They're battery oper operated lights. On pot holders there with the pumpkins and of course Christmas is starting to come out so there's the ribbon here I'll show you a little more Christmas towards the end of the video and we got some snake venom jars these are candy bottles bone dust that was fun and this one here which is brew and they had some buckets here some plastic containers you could choose the container and then there's three different lids to choose from black green and orange so they had the one with the jack-o'-lantern there. There's, I think there's about three different ones. The one with the bats. And the solar stake lights are back. And more Christmas above all the plush they were starting to get out. And I guess winter's coming. They had the hats, scarves, toques starting to come out. And they had all the Halloween tea towels and oven mitts and placemats. Hey boo, that's cute. And these were candy dispensers. So there's this, the ghost, the skeleton and the pumpkin really cute snack dispenser and they had some skulls they change color 
And they were starting to get out the costumes, of course, costume accessories. And they have a great selection of mugs this year, so shake your bones. These ones are glass. They had the spider web with the spiders, the bats, and more of the Halloween buckets, pails. Some great stakes here, garden stakes. I like that one with the spider web. And they had the distilled rat poison, the cute little signs. There was also the mermaid one. I think they're from previous years, but good find. Nice detail. And some of the Halloween floral with the pink skulls there and the eyes. And there, that one had a glitter spider in it. Great selection. Love the purple. More of the great Halloween signs. Happy Halloween, which is brew. Love the candy corn one there with the ghost. Trick or treat. Welcome to our tomb. And they had all the garland for Halloween as well. More of the pumpkins, jack-o'-lanterns, skeletons doing yoga. Great signs. And the candy corn gnome, that was my favorite. That's new this year. And then they had the zombie and the witch one as well. More great signs here. And they had the skeletons there, the bones below, the ghosts, the hanging ghosts. The haunted mansion sign is back this year. And the trees are back, the spider webs below, trick or treat, and the skeletons. They had three different ones, and all the bones. That's a cute sign, I like that sign. The fangs all here. And they had these metal pinwheels for Halloween. So they had the skeleton one, the witch one. Oh, I like that sign for fall. I did pick that one up. I didn't see that one before when I did my fall video. And they also had a candy corn pinwheel. I believe I showed it in a second or I already showed it. There, there it is, the candy corn one. That one's fun. I picked up that one. So it moves in the wind. And again, great selection of mugs. So the ghost and the skeleton mugs actually came to Canada. I've seen the American showing the gnome and the two different colored pumpkin ones. So hopefully those come to Canada too. They're more fall, but hopefully they come to Canada. So there's the skeleton and the ghost. Great selection of mugs. And this store had more of the skeletons, all kinds of colors this year. Spider webs, the wreath that'd be found on the front door. And the skeletons there, the heads, they change color. Skeleton hands, cute little baskets there. Four different ones. And they had the fortune tellers, the handbook, their little baskets. You can use them for decor as well, or if you're giving a gift. And this hide looks like a book. It's a fun find, all different sizes. More bags. I like the cat bag there. There's a ghost, the jack-o'-lantern. The little pails are back this year. They had the two different, well, the skull, the two different pumpkins, jack-o'-lanterns, the cauldron. They had the glow-in-the-dark skeleton hand there, the light-up pumpkins below. More of the solar stakes. And then over here, they had some nice buckets. Bon Appetit, pick your poison. All the poison bottles, these are back again this year. The canteens with the straw. And the tumblers. And these ones here, they're fun. With the bendy straw, more of the skeleton mugs there. And the skeleton in the coffin there, a couple different ones. That open up, opens up, you can put candy in it. Pick your poison, cute little basket. No tricks, just treats. Happy Halloween. All little favors. There's some of the garland. There's the skeleton, the ghost. There's the cat and the Day of the Dead. Party favors there. It's a cute little tray. And shake your bones, I like that one. And they had the little platters here. Well, they're quite big, actually. So they had the purple one and the black in the shape of a witch's hat. There's a close-up of the uh, skeleton trays there. More of the tea towels. Work your magic. Bon appetit. Hey, boo. Happy Halloween. Then the matching oven mitts and pot holders. Some table covers here. And more of the baskets. There's the glow-in-the-dark ones again. Here's all the Halloween kitchen accessories. 
great design this year for Halloween. There's the pot holders. Close up of the buckets. I like that fall one at the end, that's really cute. And more of the mugs and glasses. These are glass. But a lot of them aren't dishwasher safe, so they're hand wash only. This one here comes with a straw, and that is glass. And they had the shot glasses are back this year again. And some of the plastic tumblers below. The black and white pumpkins are back. This one's new with the bats and the orange. That one's pretty. Some of the fall lights below. And the skeleton is back with the crow. And the roses. There's the pink one and the one with the purple roses. And there's the shot glasses, the red and the black. Some chains, more of the signs. This way if you dare. Here's a close-up of the pot holder, so you do get two. And the garland. So there's four different ones here at this store. And here's the trays. I like these trays. Shake your bones. And more of the tombstone designs. There's a couple different ones. And for fall, I didn't see these before. The homemade pumpkin pie, fresh baked apple pie. The long signs are back for fall again. Oh my gourd, that one's fun. And here's a close-up of the pot holders again. Hello pumpkin. And they had the to-go cups and the plaid. They are plastic. And of course more Christmas is coming out. Lots of ornaments. No new ones yet. Christmas cards there above. Some super cute lights. Gingerbread house there. And the snowflakes. And I got the cutest one, the one with the gnomes. Here's the one with the gnomes. Well, thank you so much for coming shopping with me today at Dollar Tree to see what's new for Halloween. If you're enjoying these videos, if you give me a thumbs up and subscribe, thank you so much for watching. And of course, happy shopping. Bye.